Welcome to the Seesaw Library Series Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool. By the end of this tutorial, you'll be able to navigate to the Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool, find lessons from the Seesaw Library aligned to standards to support your instructional needs, supplement your curriculum with ready-to-teach Seesaw lessons. With various curricula in state, national, and international standards to choose from, Seesaw's Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool makes it easy to find Seesaw lessons that best supplement your instruction. Let's dive in and see this powerful tool in action. It's important to note, there are two ways the Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool can be accessed. For this tutorial, we will access the tool through the Seesaw Library page while logged into the Seesaw app. But, you can also access the tool by entering the page URL. For quick access, Bookmark the Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool URL in your preferred browser. Once logged into your teacher account, click the Library button, and then on View Standards and Curriculum Alignments. The Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool provides two ways to browse, by Standards and by Curriculum. Let's start with the default option, Standards. First, select your standard set from our list of supported standards. State-specific, Common Core, National, or International. Next, select the subject you want to focus on, followed by the grade level or levels you would like to view. If you wish to pull alignments for two or more grade levels at once, hold down the Command key for Macs or the Control key for PCs to select multiple levels at the same time. Next, select your content package, Seesaw ELD, Seesaw Early Literacy, or Seesaw Computer Science if applicable. Only select the content package you have access to. If no content packages apply to your search, this filter can be left blank. Then, select the language of the content you would like to see in the results. Select English to view lessons in English, select Spanish to view lessons in Spanish, or select both options to view lessons in English and Spanish. Once your selections have been made, click Search and get ready to be amazed. You will now see all of the correlations or Seesaw content that aligns to your chosen standard set. Tap Correlations to view all content aligned to a specific standard, and then click the title of any lesson to dive in and explore. When you find a lesson you want to use with your students, you can save it to your My Library for later use, or assign it to a single student, multiple students, all students, or to a specific group. Our second search option allows you to browse standard sets by curriculum. Start by choosing the curriculum you implement in your classroom. Then, select your preferred standard set, whether they be international, national, common core, or state-specific. Next, choose the grade or grades you would like this alignment for. Next, select your content package, Seesaw ELD, Seesaw Early Literacy, or Seesaw Computer Science if applicable. Then, select the language of the content you would like to see in the results. Finally, press Search to view your customized report. Once your report is populated, you will see all content that the Seesaw Library offers that aligns with your chosen curriculum making it easy to plan your classroom instruction and activities. The report is organized by unit or by module, and will display all standards that are addressed along with the Seesaw lessons that can be assigned to supplementally support your students. If you would like to save these alignments, both standards and curriculum alignments can be easily exported in Excel, Word, or PDF formats. It's important to note, Downloaded reports are fixed, meaning they will not receive updates. To view the most up-to-date alignments, always reference the Live Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool. That brings us to the end of the Standards and Curriculum Alignment Tool tutorial. If you have any questions, please watch this tutorial again or visit our Teacher Resources page for additional support.